I'm going to keep this very, very short because they're literally calling votes right now. And so I got to get back to the Capitol. And it is National um, Data Privacy Day. So happy um, Data Privacy Day. And so I'm going to talk about data privacy real quickly here, um, too, because I think this is an urgent issue. It's an urgent issue because we need to protect um, people's civil rights, constitutional rights, consumer rights um, in a digital world. And we have not really stepped up to the plate in terms of putting policies together that make that difference. And one key policy that is so important is protecting people's most sensitive personal information. Uh, and in order to move that forward, um, we need sound policy. I introduced legislation um, to make sure that we do a good job of doing that. Um, we have seen um, that people have had confusing privacy policies, sometimes buried in um, agreements they get when they have services and they click um, and they click yes and they really have no idea what will happen with their information. And so it's important that we have legislation to address that. Um, I introduced uh, H.R. 2013, the Information Transparency and Personal Data Control Act, which would really pe put people in charge of their most um, sensitive personal information. Um, in order to do this, the bill would require um, um, people to, or organizations to put out privacy policies in what we call plain English, clear language, talking about what information that they may be um, obtaining and what they would do with that information. Um, the bill would require companies to allow users to opt in. Um, so folks have to give their consent before their um, most sensitive private information can be used, um, especially in ways that the public may not expect. Um, they must disclose whom they plan on sharing that information with, um, for what, what um, purposes that information will be used. Um, my legislation also requires that there are privacy audits by a neutral third party um, because we need to catch things before that before um, something becomes a crisis, not wait to see that happen. I mean, an audit is an important part of that. Um, the FTC would have enforcement authority and rulemaking authority, um, and my legislation would also empower state attorneys general to pursue those not in compliance with the legislation. Um, these are bold and very simple. I'm getting the, the, the uh, wrap up already, I apologize. Um, but this is incredibly important. We have 34 co-sponsors. The New Dem Coalition has endorsed the legislation. If we don't put privacy protections in place, people don't have those protections at all. This is an international issue. We see the EU moving forward. If we don't have a domestic policy, it's hard for us to have a voice at the international table. So we should have a very strong sense of urgency about this. I encourage all of you to do that. I'm happy to talk more at another time, but unfortunately, um, I've got to go run and vote on the floor. So thank you very much.